President Joe Biden and Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu met at the White House amid increasing calls for a permanent ceasefire in the Middle East. The two leaders discussed the nine-month war in Gaza that has claimed over 39,000 lives. Netanyahu praised Biden for his decades of support for Israel, while Biden emphasized the need to finalize a peace deal. The meeting comes as Biden faces pressure to end the conflict before the November election, potentially boosting Vice President Kamala Harris's campaign. Harris will also meet Netanyahu separately. Netanyahu is navigating internal pressures from Israelis wanting the war to end and far-right coalition members demanding continued military action against Hamas. This was their first in-person meeting since Biden's visit to Israel following the October 7 Hamas attack. Their talks occurred against a backdrop of heightened security due to protests. Netanyahu, who criticized pro-Palestinian protesters in the U.S., also plans to meet former President Trump. Following their Oval Office discussion, Biden and Netanyahu will meet with the families of American hostages in Gaza. Netanyahu's fiery defense of Israel's actions and Biden's calls for reducing civilian casualties highlight the complex dynamics at play.